Hey everyone, it's Andrew Animation, and today we are not playing Super Mario World Expansion just because I've played that game a lot. And why can't I move my mouse? Maybe if I use my conventional mouse? Okay, there we go. Uh, so yeah, I'm playing one of my request hacks just because they sent it to me like a long time ago and I never did it, kind of like I always do with like all of my uh, hacks. Uh, it's by Random Productions. It's not Random Production Shack, it's just Random Productions Hack. But uh, anyway, let's take a look at it. I don't really know what to expect. I think he sent me screenshots, but I don't really remember. Uh, I know this was passed after my whole uh, hack removal guideline, uh, not removal, but hack like accepting guidelines. So I'm assuming it should be of some quality, uh, but I guess we'll find out. Uh, we are greeted with, welcome to random Super Mario World. And obviously this game doesn't have too much of a main plot, which in some ways is good because, oh right, I have to press a button, because uh, sometimes games with a lot of plot tend to kind of lose sight of actual gameplay, which can be annoying, pop culture reference that I'm not going to bother making, let's go to Golden Mushrooms 1. Welcome to the first level. Enjoy golden mushrooms, okay? What does a golden mushroom do? Uh, exact same thing as a regular mushroom, okay. Can I get unlimited coins here? I think I might be able to. There's some... Okay, maybe not. Because I know there's, like, some glitch where, like, all the coin, coin blocks use the same counter. So, like, if you... Hey there, coins. Hey there, mushrooms. Hey there, mushroom. Hey there, mushroom. Uh, yeah, I'll stop that now. But, like, all the coin blocks use the same counter, so you can actually, uh... Uh, where was I going with that? That, uh, you can glitch them by just alternating the blocks, and it'll reset. I'm not quite sure how the glitch works, and if I manage to die in a level with this many mushrooms, that would be really pathetic. But, uh, then again, it may be possible. And, uh, munchers, of course, because no hack is complete without some. So, it's not terrible so far. Well, it's kind of a cut-off net there, but oh well. I mean, it's kind of an obvious level 105 uh, first level Super Mario World edit, but... Okay, there's nothing over there. Uh, but it's not terrible. I mean, I assume it's probably like a first hack, which is, you know, reasonable, because... I know, like, my first hack was pretty much just a level 105 edit. Uh, guessing that was supposed to be Yoshi Jump... Okay. I wonder if I could have gotten Yoshi... Oh, well, that's not important. I probably could have if I, like, really ran, but I I don't know. It's it's not worth it. Well, unless I, like, turn out I need Yoshi later. Which is entirely possible, but, uh... Oh, well. So it looks like everything on the overworld is sort of revealed already, so there's no, like, paths, but... That's like one of the hardest things to do. There are shortcuts and secrets to this level. Can you find them? I'll try. Like overworld editing is, I, I think I've said this before in my videos, but like it's not easy to do in Lunar Magic. It's not, like honestly making a level itself is not that hard if you're, if you're inspired, but uh, like actually getting the overworld to work. Ooh, a star, and I'm gonna lose my hit. You die. I said die. You have caused me, like, way too much loss of mushroomage. I'm not sure if that's actually a word. I can't imagine it would be, because why would mushroomage be a word? And there's a pipe I can go down here. And... Oh, I guess I have to, like, hop on these guys? Yeah, okay, that didn't happen. Yeah, I... Don't really see too much purpose in playing a hack like this, save stateless, just because... You know, nothing against the hack, but it's... Okay, wow. Really? That many mushrooms? It's kind of excessive. Well, I guess I'm not going in there. I mean, that was like an alternate route. Like, I, I only play the uh, save stateless, the big projects, just because... For, their, for them, it's more of an accomplishment, and this is probably only in me one or two videos anyway. I don't remember... Overworld. Thank you. I don't remember if he told me how many levels this game had, uh, but... Uh, oh, I guess we're going to Golden Mushrooms 3. I wasn't even thinking about what I was doing there. I was just trying to get my point across. Like, oh, what am I trying to say here? And then all of a sudden I found out that my fingers entered a level for me. And it looks like it's a P-Switch run! 
No, it's the exact opposite. Uh, everyone's telling me to go down. What's down here? This was a yellow level, and I'm assuming he keeps, like, the standard Super Mario World uh, level. Really? That's... Oh, come on. Kaizo Trap, really? Did it it. Well, yes, I guess it is really a Kaizo Trap. Uh, okay, then. So, what we have to do, for those of you who, if you somehow don't know what that means... Actually, now I'm curious. What is down here? Yeah. Wait, a P-switch to get a P-switch? What? Oh, I guess we can do that. But, why? Okay. We'll go with it. I don't think the P-switch did anything, like, as I was going along the level here, so... Not quite sure why... Hey, how come that mushroom didn't come down? So I'm not really quite sure why we have two P-switches here, but, uh, oh well, we'll go with it. Boom! And, yeah, that, that should last the entire time. If it somehow doesn't, I'm gonna be kind of angry because I don't really know what else I could do, but, uh, yeah, it lasted, so we're all good. So, let's see what comes after this. Let me guess, this leads to nothing. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, may want to, I know there's like an option where you can, uh, disable a level's being able to enter. You're close to the castle. Like, you can say, don't enter this level. You may want to do that for a tile like that, just because otherwise you'll end up in that endless bonus game, and that's not really any fun because it has a time limit, and you have, even if, even though you can gain lives, you'll probably, you have to lose one to get out of there. Unless you can somehow start select, which is usually impossible. Gee, I may want to go back to Mushroom Land and refuel. Hi. Forgot I can slide. I should do that. Save a state. Well, <laughs> let's turn off the background instead. If he insists, but why? Uh, uh, oh. You know, there are better ways of doing that than telling someone to save a state. I mean, you could just, like, put a pipe or something that leads back to the beginning. It doesn't really... You know, you don't have to always leave it to save states. I completely screwed that up. Shell. Come back. Shell. Here. You bounce. And then you stop. Okay. Let's actually, like, think this through. And throw it in there and screw it up again. You know what? Let's just... Since I have a save state, I may as well use it. Like, I know the, the common thing in hacks nowadays is uh, reset doors, which... Like, sometimes they seem excessive. Like, I've seen hacks where, like, at every stage of the puzzle, there's a reset door, and it's like, come on, how stupid do you think the player is? But, I mean, the sad thing is that... Okay, this is getting a bit annoying. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. He told me to save a state here, so I'm saving it there. I'm pretty much breaking his rule, but that's okay. I should have taken the shell. Like, a lot of hacks have, like, reset doors, but they're excessive about them. Like, they'll just... Like, every time you pick up an item, there's a reset door. Anytime you have a chance to use an item, there's a reset door. It's like... Seriously, sometimes if you screw up a puzzle that badly, like... Yeah, well, I won't call my rant. Um, I'm gonna go back and find the secret exit to, uh... Whatever that level was, Golden Mushrooms 2. I'm assuming there's a secret exit, but, uh... Well, we'll find out. I seems like what I got before could have been a secret exit, since it was certainly off the, the regular path. You want to stop, like, firing lightning? Thank you. You want to give me a mushroom? Thank you. So let's see what's off to the left. I mean, the right. You know, my other left. Um, hammer, brother. But I, I'm just curious, because, well, there's a key. That's a good start. Nothing in that pipe. Some very easy to get moons, which kind of defeats the purpose. I mean, they're, they're supposed to be like bonus rewards. I think that's like, uh, I do think it's kind of like used a lot on Super Mario World Central as a removal reason, sort of unfairly, just because that didn't happen. And, uh, like, like, I think a lot of, come on. Like, I think a lot of hacks that are removed from Super Mario World Central for having easy moons, I think that's kind of... Like, yes, it's a 3-up moon, but... Well, you know, I, I was just about to go into my whole, like, lives don't matter in a video game debate, but I won't, because... 
there are oh no a shell's after me uh there are like certain uh what's okay i can't get any of that because it's gonna scroll off screen yeah okay um oh great there's ground down here what I'm hoping this is not going to be like a sprite limitations issue. Oh. Okay, I'm confused now. Okay, and I can't key juggle today. Okay, throw upwards. Do that, okay. That's how you key juggle. Just throw upwards and do that. Hello, mushrooms and three up, okay. Uh, so, let's see, we want to... A lot of, like, blue coop is in here. Hey, more mushrooms. Okay. Uh, oh, God. Do I have to go through this? Oh, actually, it wasn't that bad. Okay, now it is. I used to have, like, a turbo key mapped on my controller that would do this, but I'm not, like, sh I never really got it to work properly. Uh, I know it's possible, but if someone could, like, point me to a tutorial about how to do that, that would be nice. Even though I probably just fast motioned the entire thing, so you have no idea what I was talking about. Mwahaha. Okay, bonus. You found a secret level. You can exit to the left. There is a secret exit on E's Island. Okay, come on now. This is, this is a bit excessive, but okay. I'm not one to refuse stuff like that. Wee, what's over here? Nothing. A side exit. Okay, well, that's something, I suppose. It's not nothing. Okay, so let's go up here to, uh, this was Iggy's castle, was that it? Uh, yeah, because Iggy's usually the first boss. So I'm guessing, wait, did they say Iggy's, I Iggy's land, Iggy land had a secret exit? I, I didn't really know it was in the message box, but I read it as like Iggy's island, which I figured like, run and jump. Yay, let's do neither of those. Okay, yeah, no. I should really be using save states instead of rewinds, but really, do you, do you people care that much? Multi-coin blocks, I don't really care. I don't really need lives excessively. Those are not going to become blocks. I know that. See? I knew that. That's why I did it. Luckily, we have a feather, so... Whoa, okay. Those are going to become blocks. They are blocks, to be exact. Whoa, that's a lot of potobos. There is something up there, possibly. Maybe, perhaps. Maybe not. Can I jump over? No, maybe I can't. Okay, I guess it is just there for decoration. I mean, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with having a... What? Do I need to, like, sacrifice... Oh, it's probably gonna be a star. No, it's gonna be a feather, so... You're making me sacrifice a hit to take the boss. Okay. Well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to scroll the screen. Scroll. Okay. Drop the feather. Get hit. Grab the feather and cheat the system. Mwahaha. That's actually not a bad idea of power-up filtering, except the fact that it doesn't actually work. But, I mean, that's that doesn't make it bad. Just because something doesn't work doesn't mean it's bad. I mean, democracy is a good thing. Uh, yeah, okay, let's not bring politics into the video. Yay, egg cutscene. These things are way too long and drawn out and used in, like, every hack ever, even though they may not, uh, be related to the plot at all. You did it! Now go underground to defeat Morton. So I guess this actually is, like, a long hack. Like, this is not just a one-world hack. So I guess... I guess we will have more than one video then. I guess I, I'm... <laughs> Keep saying I guess, this is kind of annoying. Um, but yeah, so I have about enough for one video right now, thanks to my current time limit, but uh, yeah, I guess, yeah, I'll continue this another time, but uh, yeah, I'm glad I got to play this. Let me just go back and see what that message box says, because now it's bothering me. There is a secret exit on Iggy Island. Did he mean Iggy Land? I'm gonna go back and check, like, really quickly, just see if there's anything in Iggy Land. Not Iggy Island, but Iggy Land, and see if I can find anything. Well, that's something. I just, like, flew over the first goal, and I accidentally kind of stumbled upon a second goal here. So does anything happen if I do this? 
Yes. Oh, secret too. Okay, so this is worth finding. I really hope I'm not over the time limit because I didn't realize this was going to be... Oh, okay. This is just a bonus place. Um, okay, so I will see you in the next video. Uh, thanks for watching, and I look forward to playing some more of this hack. See you guys next time.